say if you a man, put your hands up high, hands up high. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new vlog. It's been a while and I hope you guys are doing great. Today is Wednesday, November 1st, so I'm starting off the month off on a good note. I'm unboxing some stuff right now that I got from Amazon. I got a new like makeup organizer. This one looks like this. It has divider so you can organize your stuff better. But I realized that you can also take this out. So I was like, okay, if I don't want to use the dividers and stuff, I can just... Maybe not. I might not take it out because I'm probably going to use the dividers, but either way, I like that I have that option to clean it and stuff just to take everything out. And you can also adjust these to fit what you want, so we're going to do that in a little bit. I bought another one from my car, but I don't think it's too big. Yeah, this is kind of too big, so dang. I also got this little dust cleaning job because my car is super dusty and I need to kind of take care of her more because she's getting older she's 10 years old already this year she turned 10 yeah so you know i gotta take care of her more because like after a while i just stop really caring i go get a car wash every once in a blue let me see how this feels oh that feels wet it's kind of cool though oh my god that feels so weird oh i want to try this so bad i also bought a vacuum for my car so i'm gonna just you know try to wash her clean her up inside because when i go to the car washes they don't they don't do the job i also got this hair gel because the gel that i'm using the eco gel i got the one in green to just to switch it up and i don't like it as soon as you put it on if i brush my hair the next day there's like a bunch of white flakes on there and i'm like that's disgusting the black one, the one with the black lid, I think it was black castor oil. It didn't do that. But I got this one because I know I got, it for, I got it for my mom and she really likes it. So maybe I might just start using this one instead of using the Eco Gel. We'll see. It smells really good actually. Yeah, it smells like strawberry. I also got these toner pads that I keep seeing on TikTok. Which I'm skeptical because I don't really like using a bunch of random skincare products since my skin is kind of sensitive to new things. Oh crap, I forgot to pick up another package, but I didn't see it in the package room. My Sephora package should be here, but I didn't see it. I have to go back down because I need that. So it's these right here. If you guys have seen them, I think it's, I'm not sure if it's like Korean. I think it is Korean, but it's supposed to be they're really good. These are for blemishes. You can use them day and night. They have multiple. I think the other ones, some of them are for brightening. Others are for like texture etc but i got this one just to see if they actually work because i've been kind of breaking out i don't know if you guys can see i feel like i have some dark marks i have a pimple right there right now because i'm on my period so yeah that's pretty much what i got from amazon i also have a package from hollister because i have to do a collab with gilly hicks so i might film that today let's see what we got it's a forest sale but look how it came like i hope nothing that damaged so i got this lineage Laneige, Laneige, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I got the a new toner because I used the one by Fenty Beauty, but I'm kind of tired of it already. So I think that I need to switch it up a little bit. So it's kind of like a moisturizing toner. I need to keep my boxes in the event that I don't like these things. Everything is like wet. I think the package got wet. That sucks. I hope my freaking palette didn't get messed up. I'm pissed. So I got the glow recipe niacin my drops. I can get this out of here. I keep hearing these are like amazing for your skin. It makes you look nice and glowy. And I kind of want that because she be looking dry sometimes. Yeah, we got that. We're going to try it out. Hopefully we love it. I guess for my mom, she likes the JLo Beauty products because she tried them once and she's like, oh my God, I feel like it's just a difference, blah, blah, blah. And I got her, she ran out. So I got her the moisturizer and the cleanser. But look how this box looks like it's literally messed up i mean obviously the product is okay because it comes in this like huge container even though it only has like a 1.7 ounce also got the pillow talk highlighter i heard good and bad reviews about this one people were saying the packaging is not the best others were saying it's kind of just empty and then yeah i don't know but we'll try it out here's the cleanser let me make sure it's okay it looks fine that's for her 
I re-upped on my Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. This is my favorite night skin cream. It's so expensive, but I love it. It's so hydrating, and I get the big one just so that I can have it for obviously a longer period of time. Mine is still holding on to the slats bits, but I wanted to take advantage of the sale so I don't have to buy it full price because it was like $89. Yeah, the biggest one is at $89. Again, that's pricey, but I feel like it's so worth it, especially if you have dry skin. I got another Summer Fridays lip balm. I have the vanilla one and I love the vanilla one is so freaking good. Hmm. This one's pink sugar. Oh, that smells delicious. I like that very much. And then the last thing that I got is this paleta. This palette. I don't have any shadow palettes. I got rid of all the ones that I have because like I just didn't care for it. And I've just been using kind of like a bronzer as my shadow. But I was like, you know, maybe it's time to to get one. And I feel like this one might be really good because it has pretty much everything you, you want. And I'm a very, like, I'm a nude gal when it comes to shadows and things. I'm not going to be over here doing colors. So I feel like this one might be it for me. It looks like these. Here's how the first four look in the bottom. I ran out of fingers. But either way, I'm excited to try them out. That was expensive, though. Okay, so let's go to the bathroom and fix up my little makeup bags that i got oh before that i did get some stuff from ysl beauty i'm so excited i got this mascara which i'm excited to try out i'll show you guys how it looks when i put it on it has a really big wand i love mascara it's like my favorite part of doing makeup i also got these two lipsticks they look like these i already put them on earlier and they feel very soft this is the second one Shout out to White Soul Beauty. I am outside in an AMG, right outside. TT, two turn baby girl, you know me. Still with the dolls that I could decide. All the niggas around me, die, die, die. Gotta watch the time, cause it's fine right by. I'm outside in an AMG. It is indeed the next day. <laughs> I just got home from my dental appointment and picking up groceries. So I'm gonna put those away right now. I'm not sure what happened yesterday. I think I was doing my makeup cleaning, my brushes. Yeah, that's what I was doing. And then after that, I don't remember what I did. I know that I just chilled. I ordered Uber Eats. I had Chipotle because I didn't have any food. And then I went to bed like super early. Well, I stayed, I laid down in bed early, but I didn't go to bed until like 2 a.m. Make it make sense? Yeah. <laughs> I was reading a book. I was reading this book, Layla by Colleen Hoover. And this book had me pissed the entire time. I didn't like it. The characters were pissing me off. And then at the end, I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, whatever. But it's very different than the other books that I've read from her. Because it's kind of like spooky-ish. So, um, yeah, but I was like, girl, no, I did not like it. But, like, at first, I didn't like it. But at the end, I'm like, okay, yeah, that's fine. But it's just, I don't know. It wasn't, it wasn't my top, for sure. I'll give it, like, a, like, a two out of five. That's my personal opinion. So, if you guys read it, let me know what you think. I have my little collection here. Let me show you. Of my books that I've been reading, I've been just killing these because they're just so like easy to read and i just kind of fall really in love with everything all the characters so these are my series right here and then these are the standalones that i've read so these are together then these five go together i love these i think this one was it this one or all your perfects i think all your perfects can be read by itself but it is part of this like five book series but i read this first i believe and i was like oh my god this book was great but then when i started reading these and then everything tied together but this one you no know, can stand on its own perfectly fine and then these three these three were a little more like not kitty but you know they weren't super like spicy and then these were my standalones i think it was ugly love that had me bawling but yeah and then i read credence by penelope douglas because i kept seeing it on tiktok and um if you're into the whole like you know sexual books erotic type of things like it's good but it's also kind of weird i 
Like I enjoyed it, but then I also kind of felt like, oh, this is kind of wrong for me to be enjoying. I don't know. So I didn't fully, fully enjoy it because it was a little, I don't want to like give anything away, but obviously if you want to read it, if you're into like the, I think it's called like smut type of books, like smutty books, um, then definitely give it a read and see what you think. But I was like into it, but then some parts I'm like, why the fuck do I think this is like good? Because I'm like, this is not, like, this shouldn't be happening right now. But anyways, yeah, so I have to order some more books because I'm pretty much done with the ones that I ordered. And I think I want to read a couple more by Colleen because I really like her books a lot. And um, I have to find other ones to read, so I'm not just stuck to, like, her books. I've just read so many of them, and I, I usually find myself falling in love with all of them right away. So that's why I really like them. But anyways, enough of my rant probably gonna order some more like today on amazon they're cheaper on amazon actually and i've been keeping them as like a little collection you know maybe later on if i have a daughter or something and she's into reading which i hope she is because i wasn't really into reading at first and i just started getting into it like much more like recently and yeah i've just been keeping them because i'm like oh you know maybe later on my future daughter will be reading my books and she'll be like oh my god this book is so amazing like these love stories well, I hope so. Yeah, let me put away my groceries for you guys. I might go to the salon to do my hair because I don't feel like washing it myself. I haven't been to the salon in a long time and I feel like maybe I need to nourish my hair a little more than just using my Revlon. So let's get this done and then I'll call my mom and see if she can squeeze me in. She's probably going to be like, why didn't you call me earlier? Because, you know, you can just be pulling up. Cause I just like to show up. I don't like to make appointments. Right outside, ET. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Who am I? All the niggas around me. How did I die? Gotta watch the time. Get the fire right now. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. I just caught a shorty out the fast. Just do all the hoodie. It's a great shot. Alright, so I put everything away. I vacuumed a little bit because all my hairs from my shedding were on the ground. Plus it's Thursday, so it's like my cleanup day, but today I'm not in the vibes of cleaning up. My mom told me to go, so I'm gonna head out to the salon. And this is a concoction that I put together. She's thick. I don't like that. I haven't really eaten today, so I'm gonna have to eat something this is like one super protein a banana half a cup of oats and like almond milk i'm really bad at drinking shakes especially protein shakes but i have to do it because i'm hungry and i have my water i love this bottle i take it everywhere and i bought these little this cute little cover for my straw because i don't like just leaving it open and i you know i get a little skeptical and worried like what if something crawls in there. I saw a video on TikTok of some girl's like Stanley Cup straw. I think there was like spider in it and I almost like threw up. So just the thought of that creeps me out. So I bought this. How cute is it? it Give me a pack of two from Amazon of course. I drink at least like two of these a day because water is life. And this is like what 40 40 ounces? Yeah it's 40 ounces and it fits in your car. We are in the car. I just came to UPS and now we're gonna go to the salon. So let's just jam out. You would think it's all mine, the way that I took it. Cause you talk like you got what I need. Talk like you got the juice and the squeeze. We could move it tonight. I don't think you would come back to me. Say if you a man, bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high. Maybe one day, when you figure out you're gonna need someone, when you figure out it's all right here in the city and you don't run from where we come from. Oh, and it got this, put it in the song, all right. Hey, you fall, one more line, the cash in here, in no time. Hello, guys. We are back home. It's literally 11 o'clock at night. So I cut my hair. Oh, my mom cut my hair. So we cut a few inches off. It was like down here, but now it's like up here because she's a little damaged. So I'm like, you know what, just cut it. And I kind of want to cut more, maybe like this much. That way she can just grow back healthy and do her thing, you know? And she cut like, you know, some like bangs in the front, but I think I'm going to ask her to make them shorter. 
when I decide if I'm gonna cut my hair shorter or not. That way we can just go for like a whole new look. I might dye it darker. I don't know yet. But we started off by just cutting some off. And already my hair looks much healthier. Like my ends look healthier. I'm happy that I cut some off. Feeling cute. Feeling healthy. But feeling tired. I went to church with my family. And then I just got home. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do my skincare routine for the night. Put my hair up. And then I lay down. I think, think that I prefer the idea I'm out of your mind. He said he rap, he ain't signed. That ain't a good sign. Change your mind. The conversation is on rose wine. Unless there's some other things you gotta mind. With him, my baby. Hey. Hey. The smoke got me talking in Dutch. A pill any reason, so what? She leaning on me, I'm a crush. Good morning. I woke up late today. But what's new? I've been trying to get up earlier lately, but I don't know. For some reason, my bed didn't let me. Today's Friday. It's like 11 40 right now. I'm going to go ahead and do my daily journal. Whoop. And segundo. Hey. I was shy with my sister. So today we're going to film the Hollister Gilly Hicks campaign so I can get that out of the way and submit it. I was going to do it two days ago when I told you guys, but I just didn't do it. I'm going to do that today, probably like in a little bit. Let's go put on some skin tint <laughs> so my face can look a little even. And then I hit my foot fell asleep. It's like it tickles, but also feels terrible. Okay, so sorry to go away. I forgot to show you guys my little makeup thing, but so I organized everything in here. I put this right here, but everything else is nice and organized. I put my foundations and concealers in here, lips right here, powders and like blush slash bronzer on this side. And then right here, I put some um, lip liners, eyeliners and mascara slash highlighter. And then I put my brushes and stuff right here this is the old one that i had everything i had all that stuff in here and everything fit but it was just stacked on top of each other so i couldn't really find my stuff but I just, my brush is in here and my setting spray is in here too so i feel more organized i'm using the fancy beauty skin tint this is very light i use the shade uh, 13 and it makes my skin look super even and nice so can't complain i think this one should be fine and my brushes are clean since my hair is also done should be quick just do this put my hair down and do my charm i'll just like set you guys up so you can see the behind the scenes of how i film i'm trying out the ysl mascara that i showed you guys that i got in pr and my camera is overheating or about to die whatever it is for usual i like this camera but the battery life on it sucks I have like three different batteries that I have to always use and swap out because after like 30 minutes of filming, she's dying. Because it is 4K, so I guess I use more like store uh, more battery life. But it's like, come on. Can you guys see the difference? Look at my lashes. This is the one with the mascara. And this one doesn't. This one's just curled. It definitely gives you more volume. Yeah, I can definitely see more volume with this one. I feel like it's not, doesn't give me as much length as my other one, but definitely more volume. Um, the hair is giving. I love it. Look at her, she looks healthy. She screaming on me, I'm a crush. Her photos don't need to be touched. She asking why I haven't done nothing. I didn't know we had a rush. Enjoy. So I'm done. I'm starving. It's literally two o'clock. It's crazy because I haven't, yeah, I haven't eaten anything since I got up. But yesterday's shake was nasty. It was way too thick. I couldn't finish it. But today I put more milk and I also added ice because yesterday's was warm. So it was thick and warm. And I was like, no. So today with a little bit more milk and then the ice to also make it cold, better. I'm losing weight. I don't know why, and I don't want to. So I'm gonna, you know, have this. I can have some protein, blah blah blah. But also need to like hit the gym because I don't want it to become just like fat. I want it to actually like build some muscle. 
It's a lot though. I'm already kind of full, but I have to eat it or drink it. So I finished filming and now I'm going to edit it to see if I even like it. Because if I don't like that angle, then I have to do it again. <laughs> it's a lot later. It's like 7.30. And I put this on because I was making food and I don't want my hair to smell. But I just made some Dominican mango. Uh, mashed plantains with eggs and like sauteed like pickled onions on top. Delish. I haven't really eaten anything besides my shake. And um, starving is not the word to describe how I feel right now. I have like such a headache. I finished editing the video pretty much. I just have to do a couple more things and then I'll submit it so that they can approve it by Monday. But oh, this looks so good. I made like three eggs because I am just really hungry. My mouth is like salivating right now. <laughs> Fun fact, I don't like onions. I only eat them like this. Basically, I just cut them up, put it in like a little bowl with vinegar and salt, let it sit there for a little bit while I'm making my eggs, and then I just kind of put it on the stove for like less than a minute, just kind of like toss them around for a little bit. And then they're still kind of crunchy, but they also have that like vinegary, salty flavor. Otherwise, mm -mm. So I'm gonna eat and watch my show. Hey guys, it's the next day and we are dressed and ready to go out. I have a lunch with a friend. Let me show you my outfit. I'm just wearing something chill because it's literally 1.20. I was wearing this bodysuit from Amazon. Super soft, Skims inspired, my favorites. I'm wearing my, hold on a second. I'm wearing my Abercrombie jeans, and this light wash. And then I'm just wearing my little sandals from Steve Madden. They look like these, Hermes inspired, I would say. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing. Just like a casual, casual outfit. And something like comfortable because I didn't feel like being super like pressed and tight everywhere. So my jeans are not that um that tight the water suit obviously is like skin tight but it's so comfortable and soft that i don't even feel it and just like light makeup and then my hair you know my hair makes everything i have my little bracelets amazon i'm trying out the the love bracelet from amazon just to see if i want to invest in the actual cartier but i might just skip on it honestly because just expensive and i'm not sure if it's worth it i do like wearing this but this was like 11 dollars, and this is like the small version because you know they have they have the love bracelet and they have the small version of it so i found a small version of the love bracelet on amazon so i can try it out because the big one is too big i have a small wrist so i have that and my little tennis bracelet amazon it's like 20 bucks in here I'm just gonna wear this white bag again you guessed it amazon and yeah one of my goals for this year was to like go out and make friends and i haven't done much of that at all so i haven't really been keeping up with my goal for the year but this is the start of that we've been trying to do it for a while but obviously like she's busy or i'm busy and then we just didn't go inside until today so i'm excited for that and we'll see see you in a couple hours i'm back home it's five o'clock so we were actually there for a while it was a really good time had some like girl chat, you know, it was good vibes. It was literally our first time hanging out and everything just felt super like chill. Like it wasn't awkward at all or anything like that. So all good vibes. Hey guys, it's much later. As you can see, I'm in bed, skincare done, brush my teeth, I'm in bed and it's like 10 50. I'm going to start editing this vlog for you guys. So I wanted to show you a little glimpse of how I kind of like edit my videos for youtube since you guys asked in my last vlog okay so i'm gonna try to zoom in i hope you guys can see that so to start off essentially i take my memory card which is on my camera right now so i can't show you but obviously i take my memory card i have a slot on my computer for the memory card but if you don't you usually have like an adapter or something so i just put it in here it'll just show up on your computer and then i also have my external hard drive right here that i got from amazon this one is two terabyte i have one that's five terabyte 
and um, I think it's kind of full essentially so I got this one and it's much smaller um, than my other one so it's convenient to carry it's literally like this is my hand to it and I have like small hands so it's super tiny two terabytes they also have bigger capacity ones and they're kind of on the pricier side but I feel like it's a good investment especially if you do a lot of like social media and you need storage because you don't want your computer to get full so yeah I plug my hard drive in and then once I have that it'll show up on your computer mine's right here and then I have folders for everything so I like to be very organized and what I do when I have the memory card on there I create a whole new folder which I did for this vlog I created like a new folder it's called day in my life so then I make another folder and I call it footage and in here I just copy all of the footage from my memory card onto the folder and then I have all of the clips in there that's how I start off that that takes a little while because you know the clips are kind of big sometimes so then I go into Final Cut Pro because I use that for editing you do have to pay for it it's $300 pretty much one-time payment I believe they haven't changed it and I would definitely recommend buying it if you are you know doing YouTube and stuff be uh before they make it into like a subscription base because i don't know if they're going to do that but if they do then it'll suck because yeah they you just pay a one-time fee 300 bucks and that's it you're good if you don't want to invest the money yet because you're not ready or whatever you can just use imovie when you go into final cut pro i'm not super savvy with this but i just know the basics i essentially go into file can you guys see that? I mean, I'm still talking to it, so you'll you'll see. I go into file, I create new, and then library, not project, library. So when I hit library, then I navigate to that folder that I created. So I go down to my terabyte, my external hard drive, I mean, and then I find the folder that I created, which is the day of my life. And then in that folder, I go ahead and create my new library. So I just I'm gonna call it just I usually call it the same thing just for you know for myself. But again, you go into folder that you already created, you give it a title, and then you save it in there. You should see your footage folder in there as well. So once you do that, you'll see it over here. You'll see it right here. This is my old one from a previous vlog that I had. So it's right here. So like I said, you go to file, new library. Now it gets you a folder that you created and then you create a new one. Now from here, what I do is I import my clips. So you do import media, again, navigate to your hard drive, navigate to the folder that you want to access the footage and then the footage folder. That's why I do this because that way I have everything organized and I can just see everything that I have. So footage, then I just do, I click on the first thing, I go all the way down, you hold shift and then you just press the last one and then you do import selected i don't change any other settings or anything like that so now this is when you create a new project you create you click new project and then you give it a name and you also make sure that your format is correct so my camera films in like 4k so when you choose 4k which you see right there this is already the resolution um it's there for you but if you want to do like a vertical video for Instagram or whatever you choose vertical or if you have like 1080p whatever you have you choose you go right here and change that so I'll keep it at 4k and then you just give it a title so then now you have your project right there then you have all your clips organized by the dates so I go all the way down because that's where you're gonna have the beginning clips I click on the first one hold shift oops sorry first one then a whole shift click on the last one and then you hit e to enter and that's going to pretty much uh enter all of those clips into your project you can also drag it down but i just find that that's simple um enough just to hit e and then it just enters everything in there you can do this all at once but i just make sure that i want the clips um, in there so I go through them make sure I just select it for each day because it, if you just do it like from top to bottom then you're not gonna they're not gonna be in order as you can see there's the number like 719 720 but then if you go here 725 26 27 so I just make sure they're all in order and I just again hit the first one hold the shift key click the last one 
and hit enter and it'll just add it to the end of the timeline here so let me just do that for everything else so as you can see this is like a freaking three hours and 57 minutes long so the next thing i do is pretty much cut my clips and you see the audio waves down here you technically can just crop it out where you know you're not talking you can either drag this so basically go to the end of it and drag it to wherever you want and that crops it or you can move this cursor this like red line to where you want it you can place it where you want it and then hit command command b and then that cuts the clip so as you can see now you have this clip right here and it's cut so pretty much what i'm gonna do now is go through things and do command b to kind of like split my clips and delete things that i don't want and once i have that then i'll add the frills like my little subscribe button and all that my intro just copy and paste in the beginning and then finally just add like a song in the parts that i need to sound um but yeah that's pretty much it not super involved but let me try to get started and then i might show you guys some progress it's already 11 though so i'm not sure how much i'm gonna get done <laughs> but i want to have this posted tomorrow on sunday because i know all the girls be posting their vlogs on sundays and i want to join the squad of like oh my god just a good post on sunday yes yes i want to i want to be on, um on that vibe too because i know sunday's like the chill reset let's watch a youtube vlog and just relax or clean up or do whatever so yeah hey guys so it's been like two days since we talked i think i talked to you guys on saturday and today's monday i actually was supposed to show you some of my editing which i didn't do on saturday i was too tired i went to sleep and then yesterday i spent pretty much like a few good hours editing my blog and i got it down from like three almost four hours to like 36 minutes right now so i am trying to get that finished today so i can post it tomorrow this is just me doing my little outro so you guys know yeah my hair already got greasy but yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed my vlog and i will see you guys in my next video bye